is a piece of work. Now he's an amazing, he's really an amazing guy. But most of all, I want to thank the millions of hardworking Americans across the nation who have always been the heart and soul of this really great movement. We've been through so much together, and today you showed up in record numbers to deliver a victory like really, I probably like no other. This was something, this was something special. And we're gonna, we're gonna pay you back. We are gonna do the best job. We're gonna, we're gonna turn it around. It's gotta be turned around. It's gotta be turned around fast. And we're gonna turn it around. We're gonna do it in every way, with so many ways, but we're gonna do it in every way. This will forever be remembered as the day the American people regained control of their country. So I just want to say that on behalf of this great group of people, these are hardworking people, these are fantastic people, and we can add uh, a few names like Robert F. Kennedy Jr. He came in. And he's going to help make America healthy again. And now he's a great guy, and he really means it. He wants to do some things, and we're going to let him go to it. I just said, but, Bobby, leave the <laughs> me. We have more oil and gas. We have more liquid gold than any country in the world, more than Saudi Arabia. We have more than Russia. Bobby, stay away from the liquid gold. Other than that, go have a good time, Bobby. We're going to be paying down debt. We're going to be reducing taxes. We, have, we can do things that nobody else can do. Nobody else is going to be able to do it. China doesn't have what we have. Nobody has what we have. But we have the greatest people also. Maybe that's the most important thing. This campaign, this campaign has been so historic in so many ways. We've built the biggest, the broadest, the most unified coalition. They've never seen anything like it in all of American history. They've never seen any young and old, men and women, rural and urban. And we had them all helping us tonight, when you think. I mean, I was looking at it, I was watching it. They had some great analysis of the people that voted for us. Nobody's ever seen anything like that. It came from, they came from all quarters, union, non-union, African-American, Hispanic-American, Asian-American, Arab-American. Muslim American, we had everybody, and it was beautiful. It was a historic realignment, uniting citizens of all backgrounds around a common core of common sense. You know, we're the party of common sense. We want to have borders. We want to have security. We want to have things be good, safe. We want great education. We want a strong and powerful military, and ideally, we don't have to use it. You know, we had no wars. Four years, we had no wars, except we defeated ISIS. We defeated ISIS in record time, and, but we had no wars. They said, he will start a war. I'm not going to start a war. I'm going to stop wars. But this is also a massive victory for democracy and for freedom. Together, we're going to unlock America's glorious destiny. We're going to achieve the most incredible future for our people. Yesterday, as I stood at my last stop on the campaign trail, I'll never be doing a rally again. Can you believe it? I think we've done 900 rallies, approximately, from the, can you imagine? 900, 901, something, a lot of rallies. And it was sad, everybody was sad. Many people, I said, this is our last rally.